Welcome to MusicMover.com and today we're going to discuss why you might not be successful yet. Success. We all want it. Success is different for everyone. For some in music, success might just be like playing in a band and getting paid and doing light touring and making a st steady side income doing that. That's success to them. Some people, success is making a decent living off selling records and touring and not having to work, but making maybe 100K plus a year. Or to some, success is huge status, like Grammy Award status, I own a couple homes status, world tours status. So whatever that word means to you, that's what you gotta try to reach, that's what you gotta try to get to, that's what you need to accomplish. But one thing is, people need to stop blaming other people for not being successful yet. Most times it's your own fault. Whether it's because you don't hustle enough, maybe you can't hustle enough, maybe you work full time. But believe me, I know it's hard working full time, trying to get a music career going. You need to live, so you need to work. But at the same time, you're trying to reach your dreams and it's hard to make it happen because your job is taking up most of your time. Now, sometimes you have to deal with that. <clears throat> but at some point, you have to make a decision. You have to look, look, at your, look at your goals. Write down your goals and then write down what's stopping you from reaching these goals in music. Is it your job? Is it because you're married and your significant other is wants more of your time so you know they might be holding you back i mean not, not necessarily that they mean to but they are uh what else would stop you like are you making good music i did a video just last week on that is your music really good you know and if a lot of people blame djs in their city or wherever like oh djs never play my stuff or if there's an award show in their state they're like oh I never get nominated for nothing. It's 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 BS. They blame everyone else but themselves. But really think about it. Did you make a good impression to this DJ? You know, impression and personality is a huge factor for people to want to work with you and to like you genuinely. So if you make a good impression on a person, such as like a DJ or a club promoter or whoever, and they seem to like you, that's great. You know, you might get your foot in the door there. But if they're, if they're still not playing your music, Maybe your music isn't that good. Or they feel like it's not at the potential to where they can play it on the radio or in a club that it'll sound good or that people will want to hear it. You got to think deeply about things like this. Now back to other things that might be stopping you from achieving your dreams. Like I said, job, significant other. Are you lazy? I mean, that's a no-brainer right there. Um... You might just be too lazy. <laughs> Maybe you, you want that dream, but you are stopping yourself because you just don't have the push to go out and do these things. Are you, are you doing as much as you can? Are you trying to get shows? Are you making phone calls? Are you sending emails? You got to do all this stuff may take a little time, but in the end, it'll be worth it. But always make a good impression on people. I've said this in other videos. It's important. And when they help you out, thank them. Send a thank you email. So yes, sit down with a piece of paper. Write your goal in, the, in music business, what you want to do. And write down what's stopping you. Think about it deep. What is it that's blocking me from doing this? And make those changes if you can. But stop blaming others. Stop blaming everyone else. You know, if you if you have good music, they'll play it. Your music will speak for itself. And you will speak for yourself on how you treat people. It's, it's important. Treat other people like your equals. And make friends in the business. Because they'll help you go a long way. But your music's got to be good. 
You got to make sure your music is on point. You got to make sure you have something there. Stop blaming others. Other people are not trying to hold you back. Maybe sometimes. But for the most part, if that DJ didn't play your music, it's because he didn't like it. If a bunch of DJs aren't playing your music, they didn't like it. Or they don't like you for some reason. Think about that. I know tons of local artists where I used to live who got played on the radio. And the others would all bitch and moan. Who didn't? It's not always some crazy conspiracy or they're just playing this person because of that. It's up to you to make a good impression on these people. To make them want to work with you. Make them see your vision and make them want to help you. And thank them when they do. Back to the award ceremony stuff. Do you have an awards show in your state or city? Are you not nominated? Why? Did you make enough noise in that area to be nominated? Have these people even ever heard of you? Do you have music out? Do you do shows so you can be seen by all these? Because every city has a kind of a local music scene. And there's the, you know, the the top people that are well known and are seen everywhere. And they're all about the music scene and this and that. And then there's everyone else. And, and it goes for every genre. It's just how it is. Get in with these people. Make them like you. Make them respect you. Let them see your dream and they'll help you. Treat people well and you'll get it back. This video is sponsored by www.musicpublishingonline.com. It's an ebook. It talks all about music publishing, how to start a publishing company, all that stuff you need to know to help. Publishing is tricky and it's kind of a pain in the butt to figure it all out. This will help you and will guide you. It's an instant download. Get it at www.musicpublishingonline.com. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. And if you haven't subscribed yet, I'd appreciate it. Subscribe. Hit that subscribe button. If there's a bell next to it. Hit that bell. You'll be notified every time we put a new video up. In the comments, please give me some ideas. What do you want me to talk about? And I will do my best to do what I can to do it. I want to thank you for watching. I'll see you next time.